from the IHTN studios, it's Braves Beat. Happy Friday, Indian Hill, and welcome to Braves Beat. I'm Benny Mandelbrot. And I'm Charlie Rode. Charlie, are you excited for homecoming this Saturday? Yeah, I'm sorry. I think I'll be busy cranking out some high-quality memes this weekend. I, th I think I'll pass. Well, we've got a lot of news to cover today, so let's get started. Reminder, homecoming will be at the Indian Hill Winter Club this Saturday. The dance will be from 8 to 11 p.m. Waivers must be filled out before purchasing tickets if you are under 18. There will be dancing, skating, and s'mores, and the cost is $20 per person. Mock trial went 9-1 at districts, which puts their season record at 19-1, with four out of five teams advancing to regionals. The red team of juniors and seniors play second, and their regionals are February 10th. Wish them luck. Let's check out what went down this spirit week. I'm a great cook, what's up? Thanks to those of you who actually participated, like me. Now let's recap the Braves' am amazing homecoming week in sports. The wrestling boys beat Hamilton last Friday, 48 to 28. Great job. They also have a match this Saturday at Milford High School at 10, and one next Thursday, February 2nd at Goshen High School at 5. The boys' basketball team beat Wyoming on Tuesday, 45 to 41. What a great win for the boys. They also played the homecoming game against Marymount tonight at 7.30 p.m. Benny will wave at you from the court. This Wednesday, the girls' basketball team played Taylor High School and stung them with a score of 75 to 31. They also have a game this Saturday against Finneytown here at IH at 1.30 p.m. The swim meet last week at Powell Crosley YMCA went very well. The boys beat our Wyoming. Sadly, the girls' team lost a close match. This places them highly in the standings with a chance to win the CHLs. Go Aqua Braves! With all the great sports results, that puts homecoming right on the horizon. Let's see how getting a date with went for Zoe and Adam. Join me and Adam Kais as we search for the perfect winter homecoming date. Let's go. So no, you want to go to homecoming with me? No, I'm sorry. Will you go to winter homecoming with me? No. Oh, bummer. Will you go to winter homecoming with me? No? God, we're unpopular, Adam. So, Thomas, I know you're married, but would you go to homecoming with me? Oh, well, the problem is I'm already going with my husband. Sad. So you get me fired up, you know, like how you fire up Clay and Minnesota yeah. Animals. <laughs> so who would you, would you go to homecoming with me? Yeah. You know, think about it. That's nice. Yeah. Hey, uh, um, I was just in the neighborhood and I was wondering if you'd like to go to winter homecoming with me. Okay. 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 Oh my God, that's another point for me. Take that, Adam. So I've been rejected yeah. by everyone in the school. Would you go to homecoming with me? Yeah. Um, I, I have plans for that night. Be sure to check out the full video on our YouTube channel. This past weekend, 16 of your Indian Hill Braves participated in the Northern Kentucky University Honor Band, with seven being chosen for spots in the top band. This experience included a full day rehearsal with students from schools in the tri-state area on Friday and Saturday, as well as a culminating performance on Saturday evening. If you know any of them, be sure to congratulate them. Before we go, be sure to follow us on Instagram, like our Braves Beat Facebook page, subscribe to us on YouTube, and email us with any school updates. Do it. You won't. We hope you will. And as always, stay, stay classy, classy, Indian Hill. Hill. Why aren't blueberries blue? They are. <laughs> blueberries are you eating? <laughs> They're purple. I didn't answer my question. Wait, what was the question? <laughs> Why does it take 15 minutes to cook minute rice? Because it says it on the bag. So if a fork is made out of gold, is this still silverware? No, because it's gold. So it'd be goldware? No. <laughs> if the world is our stage, where does the audience sit? Hmm.